Hey guys, today I'm going to be checking out this TC Helicon FX vocal processor. Um, so I picked up a critical mass for super great price on eBay. I paid $61 free shipping, won the auction, and that's the way you do it. So let's check it out. Um, I've been interested in these TC Helicon pedals because not only do they provide an FX, some sort of effect like a stomp box, but also they have this awesome tone switch that um, kind of shapes out your your vocal effect for you. And that sounds like something I need. Um, a lot of times in a live setting, you're just going to a club, or at least me at my playing level, I'm just going to a small club and sound guy doesn't really care about my band doesn't really uh isn't really interested in doing sound maybe yeah and that's not all of them some some of the guys really put in a lot of effort even at the small ones some some guys just don't have the skill set or the equipment to do a really really good job um so i thought it'd be really really cool to have a pedal that just has a button i may be dreaming for something that or asking too much for 61 bucks if it makes my vocals sound well my vocals are going to sound terrible let's be real but if it makes them sound slightly better that would be really neat so in the past i've learned that some of these multi-effect processors use more than a nine volt battery um, this one looks like it's just running off a nine volt so you can use your regular guitar pedal setup AC power. All right, just trying to get through all this bubble wrap. It was oh, without cutting my fingernail off. It was just shipped in this bubbly package, which probably isn't ideal, but at least it's got all this bubbly wrap to try to get through. Look like a fool on the internet. Try not to cut my new pedal, but cut through these bubbles. All right, I think we're through. So for me, the only um, vocal pedal I'd mess with is the Boss. I don't remember the model, but it's a big ass pedal with two switch, two foot switches and a whole bunch of effects built in. It's a little bit too much. Um, I love this form factor. This will fit on your pedal board. It just takes up one one large size pedal slot but um you know it's not gonna it's not gonna be a whole bunch of confusing effects that i, I play bass so i just want one switch i don't want to like tap in a tempo i don't want to do all that stuff also i want it to sound kind of real i don't want it to sound like dsp digital signal processing all right hopefully this does it but let's see what we've got. We got an on off switch. This is called the Critical Mass by TC Helicon. We've got a style. It's got eight different styles, four melodic, four gang. So it's got unison, octave up, octave down, up and down at the same time for both melodic and the gang. I'm more of a gang guy. No melody here. All right, so we got mix, um, and you can mi you can mix more towards the lead and the crowd. Sorry, I'm having a hard time keeping on this dynamic microphone. I'm usually using a large diaphragm condenser, so I just talk into the ethos, and it picks up everything. All right, and then uh, a reverb knob, and you get club, room, and hall. And it, I like the way it's set up. The first third is allows you to pump up the room, and then it switches to club and lets you pump that up, and then switches to hall. I want to know if it's um, separate effects for each of these settings or if there's just one potentiometer that is controlling, and they're kind of saying, oh, with this much signal allowed to go through, it starts to sound like a club or a hall. So like a room would be the smallest. Maybe that's what it is. All right, just a mic in and out. 
an on off switch on the back interesting usb i don't think this is for doing anything but firmware updates which i may have to do i saw that as a recommendation so you know if you're watching this and you're like hey redo the video after the firmware update you'll have to let me know all right i'm gonna unplug this and plug it into plug it into this pedal Oh, yeah. I feel like I already sound better. Whoa. Okay. So I forgot to talk about this tone button. And what it's supposed to do is add some de essing, some compression, some gating, just make everything tone awesome. Why so much reverb? Okay. So reverb's off. All right. This is gonna be fun. Yeah, I can already tell it sounds sounds better to me. I'm wearing headphones so I can follow along with you guys. I should have used a longer cable. This one's it's too short. All right. So let's turn on this tone and see how much better our voices sound. Can we tell? I don't tell much difference. This is off. This is on. This is off. This is on. Hmm. Um, yeah, I don't know. Mix and lead. Okay, so it's nice that you can control the reverb independently. Oh, so as you roll this um, knob, it does switch effects. It's not like gradually increasing and being like, this is a room. This is a club. This is a hall. This is a church. Okay. So here's the room. And I like that it, without turning on the effects, you can just have this reverb. Wait a second. All right. I messed up. All right. So room, 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 room. Club, 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 club. We in the club. What's the next? Hall, hall, hall. Ha 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 ha! This is a Christmas effect. Holly, holly, yeah. We'll do a little bit of reverb, just to make it sound a little nice in here. Yeah, I like it. Um, cool. Let's turn on the effect. We'll start with melodic, unison. All right, this is the melodic unison. The mix is 12 o'clock. So if we go completely lead, this is what you'd want for just like, I got some backup singers. I got some backup singers. Like, I am a backup singer. This is it. I'm gonna apologize for my bad singing. I'm just trying to demo this. All right, let's try number two. Has it sound? Oh, and the mix is at 12 o'clock. How's it sound? This one is kind of robotic. Robot, okay, so lead is, I'm gonna start all the way at lead. This is all the way, we're at three o'clock. I mean, sorry, nine o'clock, 10, 11, 12 o'clock. Let's be part of the game. We're in the crowd, we're in the crowd. Crowd vocals. All right, so that was octave up. Here's octave down. I'm gonna start as a lead singer with an octave down. You probably need to sing to really hear this sounding good. It sounds so good. Good. Hello. Hmm. Hello. So this is a 12. All right, two. 
o'clock, three o'clock, four, five, six o'clock. All right, that's fun. All right, so octave up and octave down is four. Let's try it. All right, just lead. Now we're at nine o'clock, 10, 11, 12. Hello, hello, hello. We're at three o'clock. Hello, hello, hello. Max it out. Max it out. All right. That was up and down melodic. So far, I don't know how. I mean, the pedal's cool, but these effects? Hmm. I don't know about it. Let's do the gang. Lead, lead, lead. We're at 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock, 11, 12 o'clock. Unison gang is the best so far. Unison gang, we're at 3 o'clock. It's the best. All right. That's, that's maxed out. Maxed out with the gang. All right, kind of crazy. Number six, octave up. Octave up, octave up, octave up with the gang. Three o'clock, octave up. Twelve o'clock, twelve o'clock, twelve, um, Sorry, got lost. Three o'clock, four, five, max. Max it out. All right. Seven is octave down with the gang. Starting at the lead, octave down, gang vocals. Octave down, gang vocals. Octave down, 12 o'clock. Octave down. Octave down, octave down, three o'clock, now we're a crowd, now we're a crowd, max out the crowd, octave vocals down. Sorry, it makes me want to try to talk lower. All right, so last one, up and down. Let's try it out. Up and down, lead vocals, gang. Up and down, lead vocals, gang. Up and down, 12 o'clock, up and down, lead vocals, gang, lead vocals, gang, lead vocals, gang. All right, so I like that one the best. I mean, this, I bought this so that we could do some of our gang type vocals. I'm turning off this reverb, it's crazy. Um, so for me, when I'm singing my backups, if you can call it singing, I just want some reverb and it'd be really nice to have compression, a little de-assing and mix. So that's why I bought this. But um, to add something where I could double, triple gang up my vocals, that sounds perfect. We definitely have that um, gang vocal kind of thing in our song. So I think this is going to be a pretty good pedal if you can pick one up cheap like this used 61 bucks i think it was like 63 with tax you should do it all right cool that's my video if you have any more questions about it leave a comment i'll try to get to it i can record new videos whatever you need all right turn off the tone turn on the tone oh the tone does sound better turn off the tone that's great. All right, guys. Thanks a lot. Bye now.